Kansas City, where the linebacker Jovan Belcher was supposed to be taking the field today for the Chiefs. That is not going to happen, however. Police say Belcher killed his girlfriend on Saturday and then killed himself in front of his coach. Caught in the middle here, the most in innocent conceivable victim, the couple's three-month-old baby girl. ABC's John Triffin is outside Arrowhead Stadium, where today's game will still be played. John. Well, Dan, good morning. We're actually right here on the field, and this morning we are learning more about what may have happened in the hours leading up to this tragedy. According to the Kansas City Star, it all started around 1 o'clock Saturday morning when Belcher's girlfriend got home late from a concert she attended with friends. Well, tragically, it ended seven hours later when Belcher shot her several times, then drove to the Chiefs' stadium, where he then took his own life. This morning, investigators in Kansas City are trying to figure out why NFL linebacker Javon Belcher killed his 22-year-old girlfriend, then took his own life. We heard that they had been arguing uh, in the past as far as uh, recently they've been arguing before the shooting occurred. Police say Saturday morning he shot and killed Cassandra Perkins, the mother of his three-month-old daughter, at their home. Police say Belcher's own mother was in the house, saw the murder, and called 911. He then jumped in his car and drove to Arrowhead Stadium to the team's practice facility. With a gun held to his head in the parking lot, authorities say he began talking to coaches. When he pulled up, uh, he was, uh, he, they were never in danger. He never threatened them or anything. He, they talked for a little bit. Suddenly, he walked away, taking his own life as the Chiefs head coach and the general manager witnessed in horror. The Kansas City Chiefs released a statement saying, quote, the entire Chiefs family is deeply saddened by today's events, and our collective hearts are heavy with sympathy, thoughts and prayers for the families and friends affected by this unthinkable tragedy. Javon Belcher had an opportunity. At just 25 years old, Belcher seemed like he had the world in his powerful hands. As a starting linebacker for the Kansas City Chiefs, he reportedly earned millions in the NFL, living the good life driving a Bentley, seen here being towed away after the crime. He always seemed like a nice guy. I wouldn't never expect nothing like this to ever happen. The question now, what caused the Long Island, New York native to snap? Belcher had no prior record of domestic abuse, but had been on and off again with his girlfriend for the past three years. It's shocking. It's shocking. The child has lost both parents. And the three-month-old child is reportedly doing well, staying with Belcher's mother. As for the game today being played right here at Arrowhead Stadium, well, the Chiefs consulted with the NFL and decided to go ahead and play against the Carolina Panthers as scheduled. Many are hoping that today's game will serve as a way to bring this reeling community together. Bianna. Such a tragedy. All right, John, thank you.